Well, most of us watch Kobe Bryant's sensational basketball career from afar. His work ethic, perseverance, and will to win. But KSBY News reporter Michael Torres spoke with one local family who got to experience firsthand the type of person Kobe was on and off the hardwood. Michael? Karina, the Thompson family's son Bryson was battling severe epilepsy. This led to their sons Brock and Bryson deciding to give back to a local nonprofit. Now, back in July of 2018, we spoke with the boys when they donated memorabilia of superstar athletes in return for helmets for fellow kids suffering from the disorder. That's when Kobe heard what they were doing and gave them the surprise of a lifetime. The View heard their story and brought them out. And in the middle of the interview, um, Whoopi Goldberg said that one of her friends had, had forgotten to send something. For Brock and Bryson Thompson, meeting their favorite player was a moment of a lifetime. Very special. We felt like we were very special because not that many people get to meet Kobe. Their time with Kobe didn't just end there. After the cameras were done rolling and nobody was around, we were just talking to him and talking about how Brock loved basketball and he chose to be number 24 kind of after Kobe and Kobe invited him to to come down and, and work with them. Not in a summer camp or a team practice. Kobe meant he wanted to work with Brock for an hour, one on one. After an hour of learning from his favorite player, Kobe told the Thompsons they could stay and watch his daughter Gianna's practice, who also passed away in the helicopter crash. Despite meeting Bryant almost two years ago, Sarah Thompson says this past weekend, they saw Kobe at a basketball tournament, and to this day, he honors their son Bryson. They were down there this weekend and saw Kobe on Saturday, and one of the coaches who wore a fight like Bryson wristband would always say that he would see Kobe uh, when they were coaching against each other, and Kobe would just kind of lean up, and Kobe would wear the fight like Bryson wristband too. Thompson said when her family found out the devastating news, it felt like a gut punch. Her and her husband were in disbelief and her sons holding back tears all day. But their once in a lifetime experience with the Black Mamba showed that Kobe was more than just a basketball player. He was a loving father and willing coach. Live in studio, Michael Torres, KSPY News. What a beautiful testament, the type of man he was, Michael, on and off the court. Thank you for that.